that's so cool! <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so cool! That was so amazing! Hello Zebraherd and welcome to LEGO The Incredibles. I am so very excited for this one. You might know that The Incredibles 2 is a movie that launches at the same day that this game launches, which should be also the same day I'm posting this first episode, so I hope you guys are excited. Of course, since the movie hasn't come out until like later today, I think, I haven't seen it yet, but if you have seen it, I wanna hear your thoughts on the movie. Do you enjoy The Incredibles 2? Did you enjoy The Incredibles 1? I would love to hear all about your thoughts. I am so excited to play through this game, because you might know this is the first LEGO game game by TT Games that is about a Disney Pixar movie. And that just is so exciting, because I, I really hope this means we can get more Pixar movies in the future, because there's some of my favorite movies. Toy Story, Bugs Life, all that kind of stuff. I would love to see it in Lego form. So hopefully that's exactly what we'll get to see. But for right now, we got ourselves a brand spanking new Lego game right in front of us. We're gonna be playing through the entire story mode, so I hope you guys are excited. Let's get started with Lego The Incredibles. Friday? Friday. Oh, okay, that was Violet. Talking to a boy, uh-oh. Oh, what's happening? The whole city's exploding, I don't know what's happening. Oh, it's this dude. I forget his name, but he's he's probably just the groundhog or something. So where where is this starting? Behold the Underminer! I hereby declare war on peace! Oh, here he goes. <laughs> I love their teamwork already. Oh gosh, no, he's falling. See ya. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Look away, look away. Tony. Hi. Uh, this isn't what you think it is. <laughs> Oh, oh, right in the face. That didn't look like it felt good. Wow, this guy is causing a lot of the, that's an entire set of buildings he just knocked over. Holy cow, dude. This is crazy. <laughs> this guy is actually becoming quite, quite the super villain. Oh, see, see you, Mr. Incredible. <laughs> oh geez, will we be able to get out of here? Oh yeah, nice and easy. Does he even know what he's doing? <laughs> no, he does not. Bye -bye. Oh no, where's he going? Oh, well, he made a getaway. Oh geez, what are we, we gotta stop this thing now. It's just gonna destroy the city. The underminers escaped. We have to stop this thing before it gets to the overpass. Looks like we have company. Well, this is a minor inconvenience. We've declared war on the surface world. You'll never stop us. You guys really should have stayed underground. Mr. Incredible's voice is weird so far. It just doesn't really sound right. But here we go, we are in the game. I am so very excited. So if you guys don't know, with the LEGO games, there's usually the main story, and then there's a bunch of stuff to play and unlock afterwards. So in the beginning of this series, we'll be playing through the main story, and if you guys enjoyed that a lot, we'll go ahead and continue with the game by, uh, you know, playing everything else there is to play. So for right now, it looks like we have the choice of Mr. Incredible, of course, and then we also got Elastigirl, his wife. So that's pretty cool, we get the choice of both of these characters to start off, of course. Uh, ooh, we got an attack combo. Nice, I like it, I like it. So we're gonna beat up some bad guys over this way, because <laughs> why not? And this'll be so much fun. Like I said before at the very beginning of the video, this is the first time I'm, I'm pretty sure TT Games has made a, uh, a game on a Pixar franchise, and that is so exciting to me. Pick up and throw three miners. Where are they, over this way, okay. So, what does the touchpad do? Oh, the touchpad closes it, or no? Strength throw, Mr. Incredible can use strength throw to pick up and throw enemies. Okay, so I wanna go ahead and move on to Mr. Incredible. We wanna pick you up, and then just toss you. Just like that, okay, let's try to do that a couple more times. Taking out the trash, well, that's a little rude, but I mean, at the same time, they are bad guys, causing a bunch of problems. No, wait, wait, I didn't mean to throw you, Elastigirl. Jeez, that was funny. Wow. Uh, Defeat miners using three airstrikes. What are airstrikes then? Attack enemies from above with an airstrike. Attack up to three enemies in a row. So X, square, square. Oh, I like it. Oh, I really like that. That's a fun move. 
So I hope that each character sort of has their own thing, because I don't think there'll be as many characters in this game as there are your average LEGO game, you know, like LEGO DC Villains, which is coming up later this year. Look at us go! Oh, that was cool. Were we just doing like a crazy combo there, I guess? Uh, I'm gonna do slam attacks now, do we? Okay, this is very interesting. We got like all these combos going on. It feels like a, like a beat em up game. Uh, use the slam attack to knock down a group of attacking enemies. So I just jump and slam. There, there's one of them. So if we ever get sort of overwhelmed with a huge group of them, we can just take them out that way. There we go. So we got all three of it now. <laughs> this guy's just knocked out, beat him up. Oh my gosh, I like this flurry attack we have going on. So when they're dizzy like that, that's what we do. Okay, that makes sense. So we can hold square for something. Unleash a super attack. Let's check this out. Super attack. Unleash a super attack to defeat a large group of attacking enemies. Fill the super attack meter for massive stud rewards. Whoa, okay, so we hold square, and then we tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it! Oh, that's so cool! Oh my gosh, I love that a lot! We got, a, yeah, we got a, some massive stud rewards. I wrote the 10,000 now. And there we go, we beat up all the bad guys. Uh-oh. Are we gonna have to stop that train? Just like in the first movie? I'm sort of trying to figure out. Oh boy. Oh, it's Frozone! <laughs> that was awesome. Who's steering this thing, Bob? That driving is worse than yours. No one was trying to stop it. We need to get past this gear. Can you freeze it in place? Yeah, if it stops, we should be able to smash straight through. You got it. Okay, we're just playing as Frozone. So what do we gotta do? Just point our thing at it? Or, oh, okay, we have a little description again. So this is Blizzard Paint. Hold circle and L, okay. Use blizzard paint to freeze water to hold moving objects in place. You got it. Okay, so go ahead and do this, and I guess we just sort of, yep. Whoa, it's like a giant hand. Ah, that's pretty cool, I like it. But yeah, I don't think there's gonna be a huge ton of characters in this game. Just because, you know, DC Comics Super Villains coming out later this year, that's gonna have like tons of characters, but there's not as many characters in the Incredibles movies as far as I know. Um, but yeah, it's sort of weird. Is this the first movie, the second movie? I guess somewhere in between? And then we can just punch through this? I guess so, because we're Mr. Incredible. You can just have some major punching power. There Go ahead and do that again. Let's keep moving. Okay, keep going, keep going. Beat everybody up. I mean, there are a lot of enemies around here. I could try doing, whoa, why do you have exclamation points? I don't know. But these are all the underminers, like little goons, I guess, all these little bad guys. So that's not gonna be too helpful for us to deal with, but. I'm gonna beat up what I can. I'm not really too concerned about collectibles because we will have to replay the levels anyways to get more collectibles later on. So I'm just having a good time exploring the game, all that kind of stuff. It looks like I gotta do something with this. Well, just walking into it exploded it. It looks like Elastigirl can do something, so let's get her on over here. And, oh yeah, she can stretch up this way, right? <laughs> That's really funny looking. Oh, there's a pig! Get that platform up high enough. Bob should be able to throw me to the overpass. Okay, so. Are we trying to grab, I'm trying to beat this up. Okay, break Lego objects, got it. So now that I've broken that, I can keep moving and pull down this lever. Yep, I got it. <laughs> that is so weird, I love it. Okay, so let's, well first off, before we do anything, let me break this, I can't break it? No, I can. Oh, I just wasn't hitting it from the right angle, I suppose. What is in these little areas? Oh, we got a mini kit, just like that. Okay, that was pretty easy. Of course, there are collectible mini kits in every single level. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get every single one of them. Like I said, the first time through, that's usually not how it works. Yeah, what is this about? I can just ride this around, wee! <laughs> for whatever reason, I don't really know what this is gonna do for me, but it's fun. Anyways, there are some pieces I need to use for building over this way as well. And what is this gonna do for me? It's just a big Incredibles button that Elastigirl can stand on. Whoa, look at this, she's a football. That is, that is really weird. <laughs> oh, there she goes. Is this one gonna be a touchdown? I think so. Oh boy. Okay, that was perfect timing. Oh yeah, here's uh, Dash and his sister. I think there was a uh, little baby Jack-Jack there as well. Oh gosh. <laughs> That didn't really help too much, did it? Oh. Uh-oh, oh no, oh no. Oh, 
Whoa. What in the world is going on now? How is he gonna stop this at this rate? Dad, are you okay down there? Yep, all good, sweetie. Just a little stuck. Can you build something to get us inside the tunneler? You mean after we save these citizens, right? Sure, I'll just hang out here. You guys will have to work together, though. You got it, Dad! Okay, this is very interesting. So now we get to hopefully play as some other characters. That'll be exciting. But yeah, I don't know how much of a variety of characters we'll end up playing. That's what's gonna be exciting about playing through this at first. Rescue three civilians. Got it. So this looks like, oh, I can explode this with a bomb. Okay, so we got ourselves a checkpoint. What about this? Uh, I don't know if we can do anything with this. The smelly goop stuff. Okay, so what is this saying? Psionic spear team up. Violet can also use her psionic spear to protect others. Ooh, I like that, so can you hop on over with me? I guess we gotta get over to a spot where it can be helpful. So like, so Dash needs to get across this evil goo of doom. To do that, I guess he can just walk into the spear? Yeah, just like this. Ah, so you just have to do it as Dash. That is so interesting. She's so helpful. Well, so do you. No, wait. <laughs> oh gosh, oh gosh, let's get back up. There's like a pinball, I like that. Um, but why can't I? Oh, do I have to do it outside of the little thing? Okay, ready, set, go! Press circle, okay, I didn't know what I was doing there. I just had to wait for, oh, we went on and did a little loop-de-loop, -loop, saved the grandma. Thank you, young man. No problemo. Oh gosh, watch out for the truck! Oh boy, we're gonna save the driver. <laughs> Whoa, I guess he had a whole, whole furniture store in there. You sure you're good, Bob? Yep, I'm fine, thanks. Focus on saving everyone else. I'm trying to, but I also want to make sure we get this. I can use my powers to make something from it and save that truck driver. Well, okay. that loop -de -loop I just did. <laughs> I think I've got enough now. Oh boy, we'll oh boy, let's better. build this. I'm trying to build it. It said to hold circle, is that working? Yes it is. So she has a lot of really cool telekinetic powers. There we go. Gonna fall. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that was pretty graceful. That's the last time I pick up a delivery from out of state. Thanks for saving me. I thought it was a goner. We got another one. Almost there. Okay, so what is this little thing? Oh, I don't know, but we've gotten two of them so far. Yeah, that's weird. I have no idea what that is. Uh, let's go ahead and beat up some of these guys that are all hanging out. I want to play as Dash a little bit more. Oh no, this is actually I would like to see combat with Frozone. There's like so much stuff we can do. It's crazy. I want to try. Is, does everybody have that super move that we did with uh, Mr. Incredible? If I hold square, no, not quite. That'd be so cool if everybody did. I mean, maybe they do, and I'm just not doing it correctly. But for right now, let's just go ahead and ice blast this guy if I can. Come on, use our ice moves. Where is it? Get him out of here. Isn't this just the miner? The, the, no, it's not. Because it's we saved a truck driver, not a miner. Never mind. I was like, isn't this the guy we just saved? That's not true. Oh boy. Oh, did that help? Or did that make everything worse? Watch out for that car. Uh oh. Whoa, it's it's filling up with water. Oh, it landed on a fire hydrant. That was weird. I want to turn. Oh gosh. They're trying to clean him off. Leave him alone. He's just a civilian. Okay, so I need to walk up to this maybe a little bit more. I'm trying, am I pressing the wrong button? Just, yeah, there we go, I was, I was pressing square instead of circle. Okay, got it. Oh, he's got a little slide, wee! <laughs> and we get another one of those things. I don't really know what they do, but I guess we'll find out. Thank you. I'm a huge fan from way back. Okay, from way back. I wonder if this is from the original, or no, this isn't from the original Incredibles movie. Maybe this is starting from Incredibles 2, which would be weird, because I thought this was both of the games. Oh boy. Hold on tight. Oh boy. Okay, so that's all we can do for now. Oh, what is this? Oh, here we go. We need another Incredibrick. Okay, so we have to throw one of the kids. Okay, well, like we accidentally did to uh, Elastigirl before. No, 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 not what I want. I wanna go ahead and pick up, let's just pick up Dash, cause she's here, or he's here. <laughs> That's not what I'm at. Um, and then try to, I need to be closer. Come on, just toss you up there, just like that. Wee! <laughs> you seem like you were having fun. Hold on, let's switch back to Dash. 
Grab that last Incredibrick. brick. This is so interesting. Okay, that's the last one. We're ready. Hmm. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and jump off like that and try this out. Team member busy. Oh, okay, not anymore. <laughs> okay, so what are we building? I don't know, but we're building as a family. Tap circle, tap circle. Okay, do I have to, what do we gotta do now? Oh, okay, we just gotta build it with everybody. This is so interesting. They, they definitely brought out a lot of cool new ideas for this one, I like it, oh gosh. So we gotta keep it going for all three of them. Oh, that's tough too. But we did it, and we made a cool looking incredible symbol for some reason that just magically saves the day. And that really is what it does. <laughs> what in the world? I guess it's like a shaver. That's not a shaver. <laughs> I don't know what it's supposed to be. Well, we're gonna use it. Incredible! Oh, we got a ton of studs for that too. Ooh, pick all these up. Pick all these up. Got a couple purple studs in there. Better than the barbecue. Wow, we got over 100,000 studs now. That is really cool. Uh, so what are we doing? I guess we can just go up and activate this or maybe I have to be Mr. Incredible himself. There you go. So can you pick this up? I mean, you can. Go ahead, keep tapping. Got it, got it, got it. And what are you gonna do with this? Are you just gonna jam it up? Okay, it's showtime. I have no clue. He is so strong now, he can just pick this thing up. No problemo. Come on, come on. We're just buzzsawing this thing in half. Wow. I think that worked, oh boy. No, it, it didn't. It's gonna keep moving. <laughs> They're all hopping on like it's a bus. Oh, I guess he has Jack-Jack. He's on babysitting duty. Who are those guys? I don't know, journalists? I guess so. Okay, so it looks like uh, we're inside of the giant thing now. Uh, we can do something with Elastigirl, what is this then? Stretch connect. Elastigirl can stretch connect to transform into something useful like a balance beam or a climb pole to help you progress. Okay, well let's give that a shot. Right on over this way. Whoop. Nice, whoa, now we're going this way. Oh, this is weird. Come on, quick. Get over here. Oh, okay, so everybody's trying to like travel across for right now. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Or can you not? Whoa, whoa, what were you doing? You just fell right off. Maybe I gotta do this as Mr. Incredible. They did say to, you know, for the kids to stay back, so you know what, they can figure it out themselves. Let's go ahead and beat up some of these guys. Come on, boom, slam. I'm gonna do the charge up. Actually, I don't need to, even though I really want to. <laughs> don't know any enemies left to beat up. So I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing around here, except for beating up this guy. I got that going on just fine. I mean, there's some easy studs to get around here. Seems like it's probably gonna be best yet to do that little slam. Oh my gosh, it broke everything. That was definitely the most worthwhile thing we could have done. Oh, excuse me, Dash. Hold on, Violet, can you stay up there so we can see, is there anything else to get around here? I guess it was just a platform full of uh, stuff I didn't need. Okay, I wanna keep playing as Mr. Incredible. He's pretty cool. I really hope we can play Jack-Jack at some point. I mean, I know that Incredibles 2 is like a direct sequel to Incredibles 1. Actually, coal is prehistoric plant matter. Quit making me learn stuff. <laughs> How dare you educate me. Wow, okay. Hey, maybe we can overheat the engine. Let's find some extra coal and drop it in. Okay, so we're gonna build this right here. And what do we get? Uh, oh, okay, I, uh, a coal thing. Careful. All this machinery looks pretty dangerous. Indeed. Okay, so there's that done. We're gonna move this way and break some of this stuff. Oh, okay, so Violet can do something. Yeah, she can turn into like her little, or she can make her little ball and then roll around, I think. There we go. Oh, okay, we gotta get Dash in here then. Oh, oh, yep, 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 yep. Let's go ahead and have Dash hop in jump back up there, and look at how fast we can move now. This is so cool, I love this. But now I'm sort of, sort of starting to come back to it, because it's been like a good couple of years since I've watched the original Incredibles movie. Um, 
At the very end of the Incredibles movie, the Underminer shows up as like a cool Incredible little cliffhanger. And then in the second movie, I think, from what I've heard, it starts immediately like that. It's just like, boom, they're fighting the Underminer now. So it's literally the second Incredibles 1 ends is where Incredibles 2 begins. Oh, little bird cages. I didn't see I've been breaking those open. Good. Be free, birds. Be free. I want you to be trapped in cages. Oh, here's another one. Free you. Be free. <laughs> okay, so we keep making our way around. I'm sure we'll find something. Okay, is there, yeah, there's a new move we can do, it looks like. This is the grab and throw. Yeah, okay, we, we know about that one. I was just trying to look for free stuff first. Uh, like these studs over here. Because of course, studs will always be helpful in games like this. So, we just wanna make sure we're getting everything before we move over there. So let me move over to Mr. Incredible, because that's what I'll need to do. And then just pick up anybody, absolutely anybody. So, you got it. You'd think she'd be able to just stretch up there, but I suppose not. I guess I just wanna teach you this move. Uh, oh, got it. Okay, so switch back over to her, hop on up, got it. Okay, and here's another little birdie. This might be the last one. It is, there's actually another mini key. I don't know how long this first level is, if it's a prologue, if it's a chapter one. I'm not really sure, but we'll be playing through at least one chapter per episode, so it'll be a lot of fun. I don't know how many chapters there are. We, of course, played uh, Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2 last year, which was so much fun, and that ended up being, I think, 20 chapters. It was quite a long story mode, so definitely we'll be doing that here. But yeah, we've been playing Lego games for a while now. This is just yet another one. And like I said, Lego DC Super Villains releases later this year, and we definitely will be playing some of that. Uh, yeah, we gotta, oh, I see. We gotta push this over like that. It is sort of weird. You can tell that some of these characters, like Mr. Incredible, are not their original voice actor. But sometimes they don't sound really all that correct. Like, Mr. Incredible is sort of the weirdest one. He sort of sounds like a completely different character but maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm just not remembering his voice correctly. Oh boy, this whole place is exploding now. I think we made everything worse. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's just spewing goo all over the place. Look at how fast this thing's going. Everything's exploding. Jeez, the, the amount of damage that uh, the Underminer must have done to the city at this point. The whole city's probably in ruins. Like, the whole thing is just cut in half. Oh gosh, we got more angry miners. Okay, so let's go this way. See what we can end up doing. Oh gosh, we moved so quick as Dash. I was not expecting that. Super attack, super attack. Here we go, so everybody does have a super attack. I guess you just have to build it up. Whoa, 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 that's so cool. Incredible. How do you build up the super attack? I don't see like a super attack meter anywhere. Maybe we just have to wait around and be ready for it to show up. I don't know, that's sort of odd. But this way we do have something going on. Do I have to be Mr. Incredible? Yes, we gotta pick it up as him. Let's get over there. So we've seen the super attack as both Mr. Incredible and as Dash now. I can't wait to see it for like every character. I really, really wanna see him. Now I did pre-order the game and because of that, I do have like a little DLC pack that is like basically the same par family that we're playing right now, but they're all in vacation clothes. So maybe I'll try to find the time to showcase that soon, but I won't be able to do that until we get to like a free play section. For now though, my main focus is just getting through the story. It looks like a last year girl made her way back down this way, which I guess works. Where are we going now? Oh, this way, go, go, go. Yeah, we're doing something. I guess she's trying to contain it. Oh boy. Oh, she's knocking it over. Okay, so we gotta do something with uh, Mr. Incredible now. We can do that. I mean, I think. That's usually for the super strong characters. So yeah, let's move over to Mr. Incredible whenever I can. Where is he? I have no clue. Oh, here he is. Hiya! Just do the slam on these guys. And rip this thing open. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> blow off some steam. Oh boy, we did it! Oh, they almost destroyed Town Hall. We did it! Well, sort of. Dad, something else happened today. With a kid and my mask. Free Supers! What? Uh, what did we do? We saved the day, that's what we did. That thing was gonna go and destroy the whole entire city. We just let, let it only destroy half. Uh, Municipal Herald, undermined. Mission complete, gold big awarded. 
Cool, so this is like the cool little ending level sequence. I love it, it's like a newspaper. So we didn't quite get our full stun meter, but that's okay. Like I said, we'll be going back through the levels and doing that if we want to. Uh, but for now, we got too many kits, so that's, oh, maybe we get a vehicle for completing each set of mini kits. That's pretty cool as well. And then this way, we got Mr. Incredible and Elastigirl added to the collection. Awesome. So we also got uh, Violet and Dash. Oh, 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 that was it, okay. I, I... Awesome. <laughs> I'm a little confused, but that wraps up our first chapter of the game. I had so much fun with that, and hopefully you did too. Let me know if you want to see more, because I definitely want to make more videos on this game. We'll definitely play through the story mode, and maybe even more, depending on how much you guys enjoy everything. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of LEGO The Incredibles. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Incredible Zebra, so now you've watched at the end. Now you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.